Yo, what's up, guys? Finally got my hair retwisted again, and it's a lot longer, a bit longer than it was before. It took me nearly about five fucking months to try to get an appointment. Fucking pandemic. But, I mean, it is what it is. I'm not sweating on it. Big ups to the people that did it, because I really needed it bad, because it was looking a little rough, and they had the, um, my dreads were sticking together, because they weren't apart, because of all the shit that, you know, me trying to do the best I can to clean it, but, you know, uh, it was just long overdue, and I'm glad I got it, but I guess it was a good thing that it did take long, because now it looks like this, where I got more hair than I did previously, and it is all because of that new growth that I grew around that time that was all in it, but who gives a fuck about my dreads? Let's give a fuck about the reactions. The Tekken 7 Season 4 announcement that they brought up just a couple of weeks back, so I'm definitely going to be checking that out, so let's do this. It's good to be checking some stuff out with Tekken again. Ready? Keep your head up. Think your question. Yeah, I know this really fucked them up with the pandemic and stuff. There's hope in the darkness. So we just can't be seen shit? <laughs> Is that what you mean? Okay, I've got battle uh, balancing with different characters. New moves for all characters, okay. Second prowess. On play enhancements. Better on experience, yes, please better online experience. And that had to be from the Tekken World Tour from last year. I didn't get a chance to see the finals, but I know who won, though. There's always light after every darkness. You're damn right. You're damn fucking right. <laughs> and who is that that is on top? Who is that? Who is that? There's a lot of speculation who that is. Um, I'm hearing Kunimitsu. Some people were also saying maybe Ryu Hayabusa, maybe a guest character. I don't know. I'm going to say Kunimitsu because um, I know people want that character back because she's probably like the one that she had probably like one of the least recognitions in the series because she's only been in really like the first Tekken, the second Tekken. Tekken Tech Tournament 1, and then Tekken Tech Tournament 2, so she kind of was going for nearly almost like, one, two, three, four, almost like four, like five installments overall, like four or five installments, she, she hasn't really been in a Tekken game, so I think she's pretty much long overdue for a weighted return officially into a numbered series, and not just something that's more of like a compilation of multiple characters from different games, and so, um, yeah, and it is good that they also are going to be doing balancing with the characters again, giving them more new moves, and going to try to build more with the online, because I've played the online, like the online is not the best, because sometimes you might end up getting cut out or whatever, and it can be much of a pain, because as much as I love Tekken, and I love Tekken 7 to death, especially watching it competitively, like it sucks sometimes when trying to do online play. And so, I mean, you know, that's why, you know, they're pretty much are trying to do the best they can to work with this because of the situations that we're all in around the world. And they're kind of handicapped of what they can do. A lot of people are handicapped of what they can do. So I'm definitely waiting for that. And yeah, we definitely going to see who's going to be in it. Are we going to have any more characters? Because I'm still putting my ballot in for Kiryu Kazuma. I'm still going. I'm still sticking with that because I feel like he definitely can work for a Tekken game. Like I'm, I'm sticking with it because just playing the Yakuza games and seeing his fighting style, he fits perfectly in a Tekken game. So I'm hoping that's the case. If not, you know what? I'm not gonna dwell on it too much. I still got the Yakuza games that I can still play. 
but I'm just hoping because I felt like he is well deserved a pick for the game. And yeah, I've heard like Tifa Lockhart and stuff, but um, I'm sticking with Kiryu. And if they didn't get Kiryu, the best bet I definitely would take is um, Majima Goro because he definitely also fits that style as well. But it's all on Harada on what he wants to do, and it seems like people are thinking that Kiryu is going to be in it, but we'll have to wait and see. But yeah, I'm glad that there is a season four. Um, I'm thinking, could they go to a season five if they wanted to? I think they could. I think they can go probably like one more year for like another full season after this one. And I think they can just like cap it off right there. But we'll have to see.